Hey guys, MGDH here, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past Will Damage Effective Minimalist Playthrough. Last time, we beat the Ice Palace, swordless, and we even <laughs> whacked Cold Sturk but good with the hammer. Enough of those eight fire on shots for the ice shield. <laughs> but yeah, that was a minute. But at least it's done. Of course, this is not the end of the battle, because we need to get our sword back. And so let's get going. We left the, our sword at the sword at the city, so we're going to fly back to Kikaneka Village. Because, yeah. The city should be done with it. Actually, we would have just needed to refresh the screen, but. Yeah, we'll see what this is about. Your sword is tempered up! Oh, hold it! Great, our sword is stronger. We can feel the sheer power flowing through our body. <laughs> hey, you're welcome! I'm going to do anything! Temper my sword with me. I'll give you back your gun. Sword temper. Please. Well, we can't make any stronger than that. Sorry! Yeah. So yeah, the Smithies have provided us with the level 3 sword, the Tempered Sword. It deals more damage than the Master Sword, and still has the same damage sword. Uh, but wait, the Tempered Sword is not a required item. Uh, yeah, you you're going to see what I'm thinking of now. Yeah. Where we need to go next... Uh, where we need to go next, the Tempered Sword's... Extra power is not going to matter, don't worry. Because we need to head off to Death Mountain and... Uh, what was it? Yeah. Death Lucky Lucky. Lady Luck is nice. Come on, it's a nice Lady Luck. Come on. Freaking boulders. Go away. Yeah. So you might know that the, we got our sword up right because, uh... But anyway, we need to head to Death Mountain. We just feel like the Deathmark is peace and boulders along the way. As a disclaimer, there would be tech types to get in our way, but we would have been able to do this as soon as we got the Master Sword, so... So the tech types wouldn't get in our way because uh, this is the timeline where we said the Death Mountain was defensive, so, so the tech types will not appear because we haven't cleared it. It's not like the tech types will be hard to deal with. I don't know, I'd be more worried about the RNG boulders. But yeah. Coming out of here with the Tempered Sword. First, we need to go here. Because we do need to scale our way back to the Spectacle Rock. We can jump down this way to go to the Cave of the Walls for Yeah, there, there's no point. We, we got to maneuver our way through a bunch of bikes if we to do anything there. And there it, it takes too long to go through them. We, the magic cave would burn through our entire magic meter before we'd make it with run. Oh, and we'd have to do a round trip with it anyway, so... We'd, we'd also need a bottle of magic medicine, so... Yeah. Just in case I have a pretty good... Ah, oh, you're Stephen Jane! You got the move! Ah! Excuse me, we let me know. for a little bit of memorization. This is where maiden number seven will be. And this is where maiden number six will be. Yeah, I'm showcasing it now because I'm doing I'm using the tempered sword here for demonstration purposes. You'll see as much because Because, yeah, you remember that tablet, right? One about the death, about needing the master sword or the master sword or something like that. Well, when we come here with, with a level of sword, hold on the 
Master Sword, can you get the magic of Ether? Yep, the game thinks we have the Master Sword, even though the Master Sword is red, black, and cleared. It, it, I'm doing the demon thing. This is the Ether Medallion. Its magic controls the upper atmosphere and the polar wind. Watch your magic, Nemo. Yeah, the Ether Medallion is another needed item. So, it, like the Quick Medallion, it's a it's a full screen attack. It, that of course each crew plenty of magic. I believe that Reed's enemies were viable. Don't, don't quote me on that. I was cautious about the fights when I played in the game as a kid, okay? Wow. But anyway, yeah, we needed to we needed to level up the sword to uh, get this thing and we needed to enter the so, Yeah. And we do need the We need the Master Sword to uh, hurt the final boss anyway, so, yeah, either way, we're done with the Fighter Sword, but I'm thankful, honestly, after, after the only issues with Mocula Blind and the Cold there, yeah, I, I'm just glad that we can just dump the Fighter Sword and get an upgrade. I mean, even having sword back is cathartic. Okay, but I'm not seeing you on the Wow, I think I got that beam. I mean, seriously, I'm not stuck with the freaking sword sin hammer. He's a high sniper, but But we're going here to collect the Master Sword and take care of it. Okay. Oh, and dashing through so that we so to avoid getting any surprise mines. Let's collect the Master Sword because, yeah, uh, because, yes, we do need the level 2 sword at least. Here we go! Suddenly, Sahasrila contacts you telepathically. Ink, it is extraordinary that you want the Master Sword that makes people in need, not to mention the mutant Mothula blind with fear and pulse there with minimal supplies. <laughs> with this setting, sir, I believe you can deflect the winner's evil powers. The destiny of this land is in your hands. Please leave me. So we got the master sword, and like I say, it's necessary. It's, we need this at minimum to be able to get the medallion. With that taken care of, yeah, you can go through this. Just get past the block, not like it's good, it's good. Think Jerry Reed. Oh, there 
yard. Big nasty mix. So satisfying to have options again. That's going to make life easier. Magic meter or get an unnecessary item. I'm, I went with the former, obviously, but still. Checking up on the Magina. Glad that you're here. I believe that you will return Prince to this land again. Thank you. So, if you're wondering where the entrance into the Swamp of Evil is, the real entrance, well, this is where we need the flute anyway. Make me thankful for the, for the necessary necessity of the past travel system. We need to head to, tr to location number six or destination number six. The bird will drop us right in on this plateau with the, with the two dark rocks. The one on the right reveals the warp time. Go into the swamp evil end. It's raining. Not higher. You came with all those red rubies where I came to grab them. Like monsters you see moving about our swamolas. Yeah, they, they act like the little molas if they're working off the water. Not much to be said, we don't have to fight them. Anymore. We can just stick to them. Thank you. As a matter of fact, Monster Magic is making it rain in the trunk. If you can lose the air with more words than the masters, the rain may stop. That's a little... Up 
goose of a hen. Thankfully, the solution to that, what he's hinting about, is uh, obvious. So, I'm gonna zip seat. Getting supplies. Because it's still raining. Some complications with this big rock. Oh, and nice glitch. Warping uh, back here allows us to find this block puzzle that lets us reach this piece of park. areas because they are not part of the dungeon, Santa say. They're just a, some simple... This one's just a simple puzzle. Simple block pushing puzzle. I got it.